guys, Max here, and Fluff, and, um, I know you guys aren't usually used to seeing these guys in my videos, because they're more of, like, background characters and stuff, but it's still part of my videos, and, um, also because I can't go upstairs because I already said some pranks. Yeah, so... Um, here we have some clear wrap stuff, and some tape, and some scissors right here, and what we're going to do with these is, um, what we're going to do is, we're going to, we're going to, um, put the plane wrap on the door, so when someone walks, like, through the door, we'll just be funny, yeah. And, uh, I already did it to one door, because I pranked my door, because I share a room with my younger sister. And next, I'm going to do my older sister's door. And, uh, yeah, let's hope I don't get caught. Yeah. And, <clears throat> we're going to, just going to set lots of pranks and stuff. And we have, like, a fake tarant tarantula. And more pranks in my closet upstairs, but because of me, I pranked my door first. <sighs> anyway, we're just going to, yeah, set up more pranks, and uh, yeah, so, yeah, okay. Okay, so, you need to... First, measure your door that you want to prank. You need, like, for me, I need a lot because I never noticed how wide the doors are in my house. I mean, I guess they're just normal doors, but whatever. So, gosh, so hard. And so, I'm just going to need this. And maybe that will be enough. I don't know. So I'm just going to check real quick. Enough from, for um, the other door that I want. For my older sister's door. And uh, so right now. I have to cut it. Cut this part off. And then put some tape on it. So yeah. Okay, so now what you want to do is you have to take some of this. This tape. And then, um, you have to put it on the ends of your, of the wrap. Like, like this. Yeah, and here we 
here. So we already have my cereal here. And here. You can hardly tell anything's wrong. Right now you can kind of. So when you pour it. So next what we're going to do is we're going to um, take this chocolate wrapper, I'm just going to put it right there, and like um, put stuff in it so when someone tries to eat it. Uh, when they open it, they're just going to be so disappointed in stuff. There's a cotton ball. And what is this? Wait, I know what that was. That was the the failed slime I tried to make. But whatever. Oh, uh, let's see. He. So yeah, I'm just going to try and put this into there. I'm just going to do a few of these with that cotton ball. With this cotton ball soaked in soap that I prepared for this day. And with some coconut oil, because that will make it seem like there's actually stuff in the chocolate wrapper. So, uh, yeah, okay. So, <clears throat> my older sister just woke up, and it was very, very funny. But she didn't fall for it. She just kind of opened her door, and she was like, whoa, what is that? And, uh, yeah. So, but that's not the end of the pranks. So, um, as you can see, if you just go up here, I ate another chocolate. And what do I get? In addition to that, no not diabetes. Another prank subject. So this is the one with, um, the, what's it called? The soap cotton ball. Which kind of looks like the real thing. And next I'm going to do coconut oil in this one. So, yeah. Here Here we go. go. Um, the coconut oil chocolate. I don't know which one looks more real. Probably this one. This one. It's kind of light. This one actually feels like it's a chocolate. I just need to wipe off all the oil off the um, outside of it, so yeah, I'm just going to do that and then put it in, I don't know, the kitchen, because that's where chocolates are, so there. yeah. It's done now. I just need to keep it in here for a little while, though, and I'm going to get the next pranks. So we're just going to go in here now and try and find my prank. Oh wait, here it is. Okay. This follows. I can't find any good prints in here. Then this. These are the only things in here. I thought I left all the pranks in here. Okay, I'll just make some different pranks maybe. Yeah, I'll just do that with some Cardboard, yes, I'll just, yeah, so, I'm just gonna do that, and, uh, so the next prank I'm gonna do is the nail polish chocolate prank, I came up with this, um, like, a few minutes ago, and so what you wanna do is take, um, a chocolate wrapper and some nail polish, and, uh, this is what you wanna do, so, um, just open the nail polish. Nail polish that you probably don't use or don't really like that much. And uh, just pour it in the chocolate wrapper. Like I'm, I'm just gonna show you. 
glasses and nail polish that I don't really use. I'm going to this because I don't want to waste any more of this because it changes color and sunlight. I think that's how I remember it. So, um, so what you want to do is just um, take one of your nail polishes and what I'm doing right now. And, uh, and, uh, just pour it in the, the wrapper of whatever you want to do. Like, right now, just here. Just pour it in your wrapper of whatever you want to get pranked. I'm using this nail polish because I don't like the color yellow that much. And um, also because this nail polish is not the best at all. Oh, it looks like poop. So after that, you just want to put it in the fridge like what I did right there. It's right there. And, or the freezer. And then you have to let it dry or like freeze or something or whatever. And then take it out of the fridge and then um, wrap it back up in the wrapper. And give it to your victim. So yeah, that's like another prank, but before I do that, I have to end the video here, and um, I'm going to make a second part to this video. And uh, yeah, this, this next prank is really good, actually. And uh, yeah, so see you next time. Bye!